Aloha Kako. This is Dewi Mailelem from Hilo, Hawaii, Mokuoke Ave, right here on my map. You may hear the koki frog in the back. Those are not native to Hawaii, but um, I just accept them anyways. Uh, so this evening I'm talking about Aloha. This is the fourth installment of my short video series on Aloha, what it is, its deeper implications, and how to truly live Aloha and be Aloha, which is our natural state. I'm on the letter H, which is Ha'a Ha'a. It's known as modesty or humility. And um, this can be sometimes a tricky, tricky one. Um, you know, um, there's a certain balance to Ha'a Ha'a, ha -a, ha -a, which um, I'll go into a little bit right now. Um, humility and modesty um, is definitely has its place. Um, when we're learning from a teacher or learning a new approach or learning a new system, maybe we're at a new job and um, we're learning the ropes, so to speak, there is a certain sense of, of modesty and humility. Humility in um, just the openness, the beginner's mind of learning a new skill, learning a new task and, and really um, being open in that sense. Um, and of course, um, the, the tricky thing about uh, being modest is that uh, sometimes we can be modest at our own expense. So, um, and that's a cultural thing sometimes where, where modesty, it's almost, um, it's, it's looked on as, as something, um, you know, something that's a, it's a good, it's a good trait to have. Um, but I'd like to insert um, a little tenet into modesty that um, truly uh, being humili in humility and, and being humble is, uh, is to just really step into the divine uh, soul and the grand being that we all are. You know, we all have a spark of spirit or God within each of us and, and um, you know, there is a reason why we're here on the planet now and there's a reason why um, I'm stepping into my own divinity and really my role here on the planet as um, an Aloha ambassador and as someone that has um, Aloha to give and Aloha to share and, and to reflect really back on to all of us that reflection of who we truly are. So um, to me that's humbling. And, um, you know, to come from a place of, of just truly expressing that um, without um, a sense of um, cockiness or a sense of bragging, or just a sense of, of negativity, but just to be in awe, really, to be humble is to be in awe of the amazing gifts um, that God's giving us, of the amazing gifts that we have here um, even amidst all the negativity and the seeming turmoil, there's always a spark of light and there's always joy to be found. So ha'a ha'a is um, to be humble to all this and to really appreciate and have a, sen a deep sense of gratitude for the divine and to see our role in shaping that and, and to see our, to help others see themselves as that as well. So ha'a ha'a is number four and A-L-O-H-A. -A. Stay tuned for the last video on the last A in the word aloha. Thank you for listening and mahalo nui loa.